University of Central. The windy remnants of Hurricane Ivan fail to dampen the exuberance of youth as they cheer on the Nittany Lions, led by the ageless Joe Paterno on a football Saturday in State College. If you're wondering which Lions will show up, the ones who manhandled Akron or the ones who turned it over five times last week. Today's kickoff from State College is coming up. Mike. Big Ten football this afternoon, the University of Central Florida and the Penn State Nittany Lions. Well, we've got the remnants of the hurricanes that have blown through the uh, south. 64 degrees today, though, winds out of the northwest. It is blustery, and we had a lot of rain in this area over the last 24 hours. The University of Central Florida won the toss, deferred its decision to the second half, so Penn State will receive. And we're underway. Backing up on it and making the catch. Here comes Tony Hunt. And he does not make the 15 yard line. It's last week at Boston College. And they start out right away in the shotgun with Robinson at quarterback and Mills in the slot at the bottom of your screen. The fake to Tony Hunt, it's a keeper. Robinson across the 15 the versatile center. performer in college football according to Joe Paterno Michael Robinson is the lone bona fide big time playmaker on this offense in the offensive line left tackle Levi Brown leads a unit that is much improved over last season quarterback. Robinson Robinson busts it out across the 20 Mills at quarterback now and the handoff to Robinson. Robinson had a nice hold Three off the under his belt. Slot at the top of your screen. Mills running option. And he kept it. And was hit early. Third and short. It's Robinson at quarterback. Mills in the yes, slot. Robinson looking to fling it. And he does. He's got Mills deep. Over the shoulder catch inside UCF territory to the 26 yard line. My goodness. Nice little play action pass. The white jerseys are going to come right at him. He knows he's going to get hit, but puts a wonderful touch on this pass. Zach Mills makes a nice over the shoulder catch. Boy, Mills on the inside there, just a little out and up, and you can see he gets behind the cover man, Ron Ellis, there. What a beautiful throw by Michael Robinson. As we are seeing, are capable of playing quarterback and wide receiver. Tony Hunt had to hesitate off the left side, takes it up the middle. Good vision in the shotgun. Robinson on a keeper. Robinson bouncing his way to the outside, reaching for the first down. Yeah. Jefferson, the fullback. Mills on option. Not much there. Lost the football, and it's a fumble, and UCF's got it. And first and 10 from the eye. Football to the 15 yard line. Sumner looking to throw it, and he's got it. Completion out across the floor. Alex Haynes gets around away. Angle out of Holly is moved from tackle to defensive end. And linebacker Paul Polozny is a traditional throwback Penn State backer. Safety Andrew Gooman is coming off a career high 14 tackles last week and is one of only two seniors that start on this defense. Deep for UCF. One step drop Sumner into the flat. The biggest receiver is Brandon Marshall inside the Penn State 45. Haynes again following his blocking and sitting out of this game. Important third down for the Penn State defense. Sumner under pressure. Let's it go over the middle incomplete. And it's fourth down. Penn State got good press. Penn State showing respect for this UCF passing offense. They come with the blitz. They bring five. We said it's a very Just about to halfway through. Penn State, Zach Mills at quarterback. Tony Hunt, the running back. Nice hold up the middle. Robinson in motion. Mills under center. Zach Mills threw it behind Robinson incomplete. Got some uh, pass this season. Snap off the mark. Campanos shanks the punt. May have been partially blocked, and it caroms out of bounds at the 25 yard line or thereabouts in Penn State territory. Just a six yard punt. They're going to mark it at the 26. Very sad. Not helping him through the hurricane season. Second down, and again, Haynes slips through a nice hole and finishes strong. Stacked eye. And on third down, here comes Haynes. He's hit and driven out of bounds over the near side. Sir Midas. Sumner covered up back 
back outside the 15 yard line near the Haynes not much there field goal attempt He's made kicks of 51 33 46 and 39 yards and this one on its way with the wind to his back sails through the uprights and the University of Central Florida takes the early lead to Fort Wustery. Penn State first and 10 from its 20 play action Mills back to throw has lots of time going deep and it is incomplete pass to Teddy for Gerald Smith third down third at about six Mills lots of time nearly intercepted on the play first down to the 38 yard line for the Golden Knights in their own territory Haynes able to break tackles gets out to the Sumner to Haynes First to 47. Steady diet of Alex Haynes. Matthew Rice makes the tackle. Sumner in the shotgun. Blitz coming. Sumner overshot as intended receiver. First down of the 20 yard line for Penn State. They fake the reverse to Robinson. Austin Scott gets his first carry in two weeks again. Robinson, a little run pass option. He's going to take it on the run, and he got a good seal. Out across the 35. Yeah, Tyler, it's going to be exciting. Mills on first down, play action, sets up a screen. Jefferson out of the backfield. With a convoy of blockers into UCF territory and out of bounds near the 43 yard line. First down on a 20 yard gain. Yeah, thinking to the outside here. Just a beautifully executed play by Mills, drawing the defense into him. And look at the blue jerseys out there in front of Paul Jefferson. Third down and 12. That's the reason why he's only 14 and 14 as a starter. Smoko the tight end for a first down of a 30. Mills, lots of time. Screens it out. Austin Scott got a key block. Inside of the 30. Mills with time winding down to the play clock. Good protection. Got a man out there. First and goal. Phillips to the five-yard line of separation look at the time Mills has to throw the ball he's looking to his left the whole way throws a nice pass and you can see the separation that Terrence Phillips has put between himself the fullback in motion to the outside of the end zone touchdown Tony Hunt followed Jefferson the fullback off the right side of the line and Penn State continues to work the fringes of it's all but up this hole there you see the guard coming around Tyler Reed makes a nice block Jefferson leads him right into the hole that is that's the way you draw 941 left to go Tony Hunt with an escort from Paul Jefferson Penn State into the lead Haynes gets a hole off the bottom portion of the offensive line the left side. Sumner Knocked down, Gooman blitzing in, knocked it down. They brought a late blitz with it. They can't do it with just four. Here you see Gooman coming from the right side of the screen, coming late, and his back, Alex Haynes, just whiffs on the block. Hunt slips a defender, breaks another tackle. Hunt inside Golden Knights territory to the 44-yard line. Mills still has it. Over the top. Nearly intercepted. Walker, did he pull it down? Yes, he did. He hung on to it, and it's another turnover for Penn State. Closing speed on that ball as well. Second Penn State turnover of the day. UCF goes to the ground and for nothing. He's the freshman. Israel, quick toss into the flank. Darcy Johnson makes the catch, but he's buried immediately by Alan Zermitis. Israel under a blitz hit as he throws the ball off the hands of the intended receiver again Randy well you can see Penn State has been blitzing all day you see Cronin from the outside coming in and Penn State is admitting they're not going to get in confirmation high snap just did get it away short kick and making the catch Calvin Lowry inside the 30 sideline now well, Robinson is back in the game he's split out to the top of the screen and here comes Hunt nice move there beautiful spin move Hunt to the 10 to the 5 reaching for the end zone for the touchdown oh what a run by Tony Hunt 26 yards 
getting tracked here. Nice job cutting back right there. Sees the whole good vision, breaks that tackle, and then it's just speed into the end zone, and he's got enough to street, stretch out right there and lands on that right shoulder, and that seems to be a little stinger that he had. Nice job cutting back, and boy, when you've got vision like this and enough move. speed and balance, now you turn your speed on, you get in there. Those are the kinds of offensive plays Penn State really has it. They've got to start questioning themselves. UCF three and out in its last two possessions. Penalty marker down early here. Israel on the pass, deflected and intercepted. Intercepted by Dan Conner, the true freshman linebacker. Get this ball into the end zone, try and break his spirit. Robinson, the bottom of your screen. Mills looking that way. Lots of time. Got the underneath receiver for a first down. First and goal coming up. It's time. Watch how Gerald Smith comes all the way across the field. He can run away with his speed from that coverage. You don't have time for that play to develop. Looking to break this thing wide open. Austin Scott inside the five and swarmed under near the... Not quite there. On the tailback. Play action. Little swing pass into the end zone for the touchdown. John Bronson. Former deep pass. And boy, does he like it. 21 second quarter points. And this should be returnable. Huggins. Slips on his own. Goes down. They're going to try and do something. Really need to protect the ball and not make this any worse. Looks like Coordinator they're... Lance Thompson came from the uh, NCAA champion LSU stand. Kind of a busted play. It looked like here. three man down line for Penn State. They're coming with the blitz. Quick toss to the sidelines. Incomplete. Huggins. Take a look at him break on this ball. He starts coming forward a good two or three steps before. Warren gets kind of a line drive kick away. Lowry from his 47 running laterally now turns up field. Into Golden Knights territory inside the 40 yard. Snap dropped, covered up. UCF says they've got it, and they do. Third turnover side of the field. You were saying that they try to run out the clock. Now maybe a little different theory. Well, I think they want to get something positive going. Second they want to and 12. Israel under pressure immediately gets it away over the she middle is it the one that blasted Akron or is it the one that lost to Boston College so far it's looking more and more like the one that blasted Akron. Penn State four of six and third downs they'll need four yards to get this one and Austin. Mills in the shotgun intercepted Walker down the sidelines, one man to beat Zach Mills, and he's taken out of bounds. Mike Walker on the interception, the penalties against Penn State. Blitz coming, Israel over the top into the end zone, knocked away beautifully by Calvin Lowry. Haynes, the lone setback, the give Haynes. To the outside, Dan Conner, the Marshall, the big wide receiver in motion to the right. Israel takes, waggles right, gets a good block, takes it himself. He's inside the five, down to the four. Smith, the senior receiver, called that meeting you spoke about. UCF going for the field goal, a 22-yard field goal attempt. Matt Prater, here's the snap, the placement of the kick is up, and it is good. So they thought about it, perhaps, thought about going for the touchdown but settle for the field goal and we reach halftime with the Penn State Nittany Lions leading the UCF Golden Knights 21 to 3 to Mike Gleason and John Cooper in the Big Ten studio got this third quarter just about set to get underway second half here's Robbie Gold's kickoff Sails into the end zone deep, and matter of fact, at the crossbar of the goalpost. Continues at quarterback. Got a slot at the top of your screen. Haynes hit in the backfield by Rice. Second and ten. Quick toss, Israel into the flat. They finally get Luther Huggins. 91 total yards is all she wrote for the Golden Knights. And only one of nine on third downs. They did not have a first down in that second quarter. Football just across the 30-yard line. 
One step drop, quick toss to Turner on the flank. Good short tackle, Four, five man. yards on first down. Keep the chains moving. Low pass there, incomplete. Capers tried to make First a shoe screen. Has struggled on third downs. Israel gets his man for a first down out of your screen. Haynes slips a couple of tackles. Hit by well, They contain him with the pass rush. They haven't given the quarterback time to see those people and hit him. Haynes has to make something on his own once again. You see there are a lot of bigger concerns going on as well. Israel nearly intercepted by Polozny. Darcy Johnson, the intended receiver. Israel trying to force that ball in. Here you take a look at Polozny. Reads the play, comes right underneath the receiver, and you won't get many opportunities to make an easier interception like that. What's that they say, Wayne? The reason Mills is in the slot at the top of your screen. Here comes Tony Hunt with running room. To the 42-yard line. Have no seniors in that offensive line, and they are, are playing very well. They are opening up some holes. This is the kind of running game Penn State needs. Second down for Penn State. Mills back at quarterback to Robinson at wide receiver, and Robinson into UCF. Hunt slips up the middle and is covered the tail of the tandem with the offset eye. Mills under some pressure. Let's it go back over the middle. Gerald Smith's got it for a first down. Austin Scott weaving his way Pounding them in between the tackles. A mishandled handoff, and UCF has it. I know there was some miscommunication to it. Kyle Israel has been in a quarterback since the second quarter. Alex Haynes met a posse up here. He was in the doghouse early, as you remember. Back to throw, Israel, swing pass to get Haynes on the flank, and Polozny equal to the task, and a good open field tackle of a fleet. That happened a couple of times today. Well, they've got Dan Connor and Polozny on the field together, along with Tim Shaw. Polozny Buz does a nice job of getting out there, and then he brings him down one-on-one. -on -one. Nice job. Third down attempt. Blitz coming. Israel's pass off the bus. Yes. They'll play everybody close, right? Third down. Mills. Oh, great right throw on the slant to Robinson and a first down of across the 45. As you called it, here you see Mills coming right at you. Look at the zip on this ball. <laughs> Robinson not afraid to catch He's that. Getting goal. his touches. Robinson at quarterback takes it on the keeper. Around the end, in the and tail indeed. of the tandem in the eye. Now he's deployed in motion. Third down for Penn State. Mills to Robinson. Robinson can't get away from Hamilton, and he yanks for UCF. Campanos. Capers puts up the fair catch signal. Muffs it. Up for grabs and recovered by Penn State. Inside the five-yard line. Come into a situation like this, you've got to play near perfect ball. You can't make these kind of mistakes, especially on the road against a good team. And UCF has had a couple of ball to the two yard line. Zach Mills fumbled the snap, and it's UCF football. For UCF, Israel to the flank, the ball tipped incomplete. Gooman. Israel from the end zone. Well covered, Brandon Marshall. Zermitis had the coverage. The pass overthrown and complete its fourth down. Field position. Through the hands and through the end zone for the safety. Snap went right through the hands of Aaron Horn, who did not look it in. My goodness. It is all coming apart. Take a look. It looked like a very oh, good yeah. snap. Very catchable ball and just a misplay right there by Horn. He might have been looking to see where the uh, pressure was going to come from that type of thing but this goes through his hands through the end zone that's a safety and now he'll get a chance to high end over end kick out across the 40 yards I should say 
First and ten for the Nittany Lions. Pump fake by Mills. His pass coming up short, but caught. Great adjustment by Smith. Gerald Smith coming back against the coverage. Slips as he tries to come back, and that allows Gerald Smith to come back and get it. Take a look there as you see Walker slip. It's because of that that Gerald Smith has the room to come back and make the catch. At the UCF 33. All right, take a look. Right guard, right tackle, left guard pulls over. Look at that hole. Great job of not only blocking, but sustaining your blocks, staying on your man. That play takes a little longer to develop because it's a little counter action in the backfield. And Tony Hunt just runs through a huge hole. Take a look at ground level. Boy, I tell you what, Tony Hunt's running. You don't have a lot of time. When you really get the feeling that George O'Leary wants this kid to succeed, wants this guy. Brandon to Marshall in motion. Israel gets it away for a first down. Huggins running away from the field. Finally torn out of bounds. Inside the nine. Under immediate pressure, Israel able to step up but not get away. Offensive line didn't get the count. I mean, look at all the blue jerseys back there. There you see Paxson, which leads the way, but then you see three receiver set out of the shotgun. Israel had time initially, shovels it forward, nearly intercepted by Shaw. Alford had the pressure, had the quarterback. Turnovers. First and 10, Penn State at the Indy Line 21. Zach Mills continues at quarterback going over the top. Robinson over the shoulder, catch sensational play to the 41 yard line of the Golden Knights. And to send a signal, trying to throw the ball deep, open things up. This is not so much for this game as it is for the upcoming season. And what a beautiful job Michael Robinson does right there watching that ball in. He is the big playmaker in this Penn State offense. Maybe the only big time playmaker they have. The biggest He's not a natural receiver. Mills. Lots of time, gets it away, Robinson, did he catch it? No, he did not have possession as he went out of bounds with the near side, almost. Here we're gonna get a great look at it, see if he bobbles it and has possession. Boy, I didn't see any bobble at all. He caught that ball and even tucked it away. See if we can see the foot come down. Burl Sell is the technical advisor in the press box. He can, uh, Burl Sell saw enough video evidence to support the call on the field. Third down at 11, and Zach Mills under pressure immediately through the hands of the fullback Paul Jefferson in complete. Moffitt's a good athlete, pretty good arm. Short drop, quick throw, right side, penalty marker down. Zermitis knocked it away from. Too quickly, and that's what we're going to have the interference call against Zermitis. Get you 29 yard line, Golden Knights territory. Moffat the one step drop, Capers nabbed immediately, and Wire Phillips right there. You can take risks on defense. Moffat again, pump fakes once, able to get away and get the first down. Down to the 41 yard line. Penalty marker down early. Moffat again over the top, got his man out of bounds of the near side. Nice catch. <laughs> yep, illegal motion. Illegal motion. Now as the defense is on the field for Penn State. Second down and 15 for Moffitt. In traffic, knocked away incomplete. Wonderful Brandon. thing, but there's going to be a lot of things to work on for Penn State. Chris Ganter on a quarterback now for Penn State. Austin Scott trying to get around the end. Especially, and especially at home. You got it. Three receivers set now for Ganter and company. Quick throw over the middle, and it's incomplete. I'm not sure if it was Campanos gets this one away. Beautiful spiral. Capers muffs it, picks it up. Got a fortuitous bounce. Inside the 40 and down the sidelines. Cuts it back now to the 30. He's going to go all the way to the house. Touchdown. In Penn State territory, Zach Mills back at quarterback now. Tony Hunt on the sweep. Gets across the 20 to second down. Austin Scott. Penalty marker flies. Scott has a first. You got it. Robinson, the quarterback in the shotgun on second and long. 
Robinson fakes the handoff. The keeper. He's out across the 20 to the 22 yard line. Turn one of those interceptions into Dead the ball, touchdown. Ball. Personal foul. Number 19 on the offense. Boy, he missed the third weekend of the season in the final non conference game. Mills screens it out. Austin Scott tackled nicely. Campanos from the end zone just did get it away. Penalty marker down. Kicker was knocked down. And this punt caroms away from the return man. Tavares Capers and is down by the Nittany Lions. Of everybody back. This might be the roughing. Yes, this is going to be the 15 yarders. Campanos took a pretty good hit. Well, his second down. Scott finds a nice hole. Finds running room to the 40. To the 50 and is taken out of bounds. Just a nice job. Look at the pulling guard right there. Nice blocks. Opens up that hole. And Austin Scott being able to enjoy some of the running daylight that Tony Hunt has had all day. Those guys get a chance to play. Their concentration is going to be what it needs to be. Sometimes it's really the starters. Although Michigan now 2-1. and one. We're ready to throw it. Ooh, a nice pass to the near side. Nice. The Red Roof ends with Red's hot deals and special discounts. You only get online at redroof.com. Morelli on fourth down. Got a receiver on a lunging grab. Is it enough for the first down? It depends on the spot of the ball. Catch made by Kinta Palmer. Tapping that ball out there. As you see, it's going to be Gerald. He did it. Up the middle. Breaking tackles to the end zone. That's a touchdown. Mike Gasparato. Gasparato, the senior, 21-yard touchdown gallop. Don't let this happen. Watch all the missed tackles. Nice job here by Gasparato. Couple right there. Two missed tackles on that. Don't give up those easy touchdowns. Maybe some questions in the ground game with the injuries they've had there. No question on Penn State. And they're going to face a few of those teams along the way. They're going to face a couple of them along the way. Absolutely. Time winding down on this one, and that'll do it. Joe Paterno heads across the field. Shake hands with George O'Leary. Paterno's 341st victory. 37 to 13 Penn State. We send it back to the Big Ten studio. Mike Leeson and John Cooper.